is just giving me all types of what I needed right now. It's what is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Helene Friday if you are new and you can already tell by the title of this video we are getting into another clothing haul. So the title behind this video was because your girl was supposed to be going off the country next week to be exact. April 1st through the 4th we were supposed to be in Cancun but our passports won't be here in time. Totally okay. Chuck it up to God. It's whatever it is, what it is. They'll be here for the next trip. So definitely stay tuned for that. But I wanted to give you guys some ideas because I know it's traveling season. Spring break just ended or it's starting for some of you guys. And you guys are traveling to a lot more tropical places this year. So y'all need some info. Has anyone else been sucked up into the realm of Instagram shopping? Because yeah, I'm definitely with you. The amount of orders that I have placed from Instagram boutiques is ridiculous. They know exactly who they're advertising to, but the clothes are so so freaking cute. Started from different places like Shein, um, the Mac collection. If you guys seen that swim, the that swimwear line. Uh, what else? Pretty little thing. Uh, undressed fashion. Um, touch dolls. So there's a bunch of different brands that you guys may recognize within this haul. And majority of the stuff I will have listed below. But if there is anything that's not listed below, I will definitely make sure that anything that's not listed below, I'll leave on the screen with the place that I got it from. And, the, and also my new sizing because if you've been following me along this weight loss journey, yeah, actually, you know what? I'm gonna give credit to myself. This weight loss journey because it has been a journey even though sometimes we get stagnant and we fall off. Um, yeah, this weight loss journey, we have all new sizes, all different styles of clothes now because I feel a little bit more confident in my body, which is good. Um, I, I, it feels weird to say that out loud, but you know, get comfortable with changing and embracing the change is so important. 2021, I'm changing my mindset. Let's get into this dress haul um, and I hope you guys enjoy. Before we get into it, make sure you know, you already know, <laughs> you already know. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs down, thigh. <laughs> Don't make me know, never mind. <laughs> Why not? What is that one top? Put it on? I'm putting everything on. I'm putting everything on this summertime. Try me. <laughs> I didn't even warm y'all up though. I just came came out the box with the first one being a banger. So this first dress that I have on, I, you see how why I had to put this mirror right here? Because this angle would not have worked. It's a long, if you can see, direct your eyes to the back of the screen over here. This is a long sheer bodycon dress and I am so here for it. The print is like a mixture between uh, like a tiger print yeah, no, it's just looking like tiger to me. The color is beautiful. I love the way that it lays. I do not have a bra on, but if you are a little bit more heavier chested than I am, then I would definitely suggest some type of pasties or something. Um, but for me, the girls are just chilling. <laughs> I love the way that this dress looks. I love that it fits. Um, if you end up seeing my uh, panty line in some of these outfits, that's because that time okay and I'm sorry I can't control what has to be worn under undergarments okay. this is this dress I honestly y'all will definitely see me wear this it has this cute slit at the bottom what I envisioned wearing this dress with was uh, these cute um, clear slip-on sandal heels that are just nude on the bottom honestly you could just do like a white or you could even pull on a yellow to brighten it up a little bit the options are limitless especially with the color scheme it just looks so, this, come on pretty little thing. This was a look. And I did get this dress in a, what size? Oh, cool. Doesn't even have a tug. Okay, I got this dress in a 10, you guys, but honestly, I think I probably could have gone for an eight, just given the material. It has like that underlining layer. Let me pull it up so y'all can see. This underlying like slip layer, um, that's really form fitting to your body so it does not move it's not like one of those like loosey you know those dresses you used to wear when you were like 12 years old <sighs> i think i ordered one like it y'all will see but anyways definitely could have gone for a size down just given the fact that it is a little bit stretchier material um and if you want it to be you know kind of form fitting but nevertheless it fits very comfortably i feel like i could eat in this i could have danced in this i could have had bottomless Margaritas and tacos and oh, next outfit, y'all. 
Okay, guys, so actually that was the only dress that I had for Pretty Little Thing. Everything else was like bottoms and uh, jumpsuits, which will be in a different haul, or I might end up just saving them. We don't know, we'll see. This dress that I'm wearing is Fashion Nova. Yes, you guessed it, Fashion Nova. Um, this is their Amelia slip dress. Let me step back a little bit so you guys can kind of see a length check and see how short it is on me, long it is on me, whatever. Um, I am 5'8", um, and I got this dress in an extra large. I got an extra large because it's that silky material and you just never know, okay? I would rather be safe than sorry, so always order up um, when you're ordering any silk, unless you like are for sure on your size. But maybe if you're trying to figure it out like me, I would definitely just order a size up. I love this dress. It was honestly just one of those simple and sleek dresses. I probably wasn't gonna end up taking this on the trip, um, but it is definitely a vacation dress or just a spring, summer. Look, black will always be in no matter what time of year it is. Black is always an essential color to have in your wardrobe. And the shortness of the dress and the little frill makes it like that summer, spring vibe, but you can still wear it a dark color like black. So that is this dress. Really nothing to talk about it too much. Um, the straps are literally a shoestring. <laughs> you have to tie them together. Um, so that however high or low this is, is totally dependent on how tight you tie these straps. Um, and it goes, I don't know, not really deep in the back. It's just right underneath. So if you're uncomfortable with this, like hanging over, I would be mindful of that, but you can always just like strap it up. I just want to be real because I know my followers are like, a lot of you guys are from when we used to do like just plus size clothing hauls and now I kind of like switched a little bit and like, whoa, whoa, what happened to the size of Talaya? I still want to be mindful of everyone who is watching my channel. The majority of these clothes are super stretchy material, so you do not have to feel uncomfortable about shopping or looking for similar pieces. I could definitely see myself like prance around in this though, for sure. Like with a cute, I probably would make it summery by doing a yellow bag or a pink bag. Sorry I'm moving around so much. It's just because I'm like imagining what type of things I would wear it with. Get really soft on accessorizing on the neck. Uh, I don't really wear jewelry on my wrist. I don't really care for wrists jewelry too much you may see me on a watch every now and again but i like to keep it pretty simple when it comes to jewelry um what else shoes you can play it up you could do white you could do pink you could do yellow i personally would would do a pop of color with this black dress just so that you can make it a little bit more than just a black dress but that's the beauty of black dresses is that that's just a little bit baby Okay, let's get into the next. Don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me because I already know. This would have been so bomb in Cancun, you guys. Ugh. This is the look. This is the one right here. This is the one we were waiting for. Fashion Nova came through with this one. Okay, this is the Love Again set. Um, direct your eyes to, yep, the mirror so I can get close. So you guys can get a closer look. So we have a cute high slit right here. Hello, hello thigh. Um, a cute high slit. Actually, I think this is supposed to be, yeah, it's supposed to be like that. So the slit is supposed to be kind of in the front. So when you walk, it's like, <laughs> y'all, this was the look. <laughs> and I'm honestly so sad. I probably could have gotten this in a medium. I got a large in this. Um, the sleeves are a lot bigger than what I thought they would have been. Here's the thing, that's silk for you. You never know. Judging based off of this, uh, if you are 180 pounds, like me, and you, we have similar body types, I probably would order a medium um, because even when I was trying them on the first time, I was like, oh yeah, I'm probably gonna get this taken in just because, yeah, it just, it fits. It, I just know how it could fit even more. And the color, the emerald green, it is just giving me all types of what I needed right now. It's giving me everything that I needed right now. And it's okay because it'll still be here. It'll still be giving me in a couple months. Wait on it. Okay guys, let's get into the next outfit. This is going by really fast. I gotta hurry up anyway because I'm in class at five o'clock and I stay doing stuff for you guys. It's three o'clock on the dot right now. Um, and we take risks. Uh, we take risks. Uh, uh, we take risks. Okay, let me. 
stop taking a risk. Okay, guys, I know these two don't go together necessarily, but I had no other way to show you the the skirt without showing you the top or like just putting on a random top. So here we are, look, okay. This skirt is from Shein. We have switched boutiques now. I'm just gonna show you guys all the clothes that I got from Shein and then we'll switch over to the next one. So this skirt, not the top, this skirt is from Shein. I will leave the name of it on the screen because there wasn't a tag attached. Um, and I got this in a large. There is little to no stretch. So be mindful of that when you are ordering um, this item. However, I will say, mine is like me being bloated today. I will say that like on a regular day, I probably could have gotten a medium or no, I definitely got a large on purpose because of the hits, but I could go get it altered on the waist a little bit so that it really cinches in and fits nicely. In person, this green is a lot more brighter than what it's pulling up on camera. Um, there's two small slits at the bottom, which makes it really comfortable and not just like a super just tight form fitting skirt all the way down with no stretch. Um, I really feel like there's not much to say about this skirt. I bought it to go with this one top. Let me show you the top real quick. Okay, so I bought this skirt to go with this top, which I also got from Shein. But once I paired them together, I wasn't really feeling it like that. I'm just like, eh, it wasn't giving me the vision that I was looking for. Um, but this top is really cute. It's actually a full bodysuit, um, and then the sides are adjustable, so they cinch in, and you can make it as high or as low as you want it. I really like this piece, but it'll be included in another clothing haul, so you guys will have to subscribe and turn on my bell notifications for that. But yeah, you guys, so this is the top. I noticed, like, even as I'm, like, walking around, it kind of is riding up because there is that extra room on the waistline. Um, or maybe I just needed to pull it low. Is it meant to be like a low skirt? I don't know, I just feel like for my body shape, low skirts just don't look the best on me. I feel like I look better in a high-waisted, but oh, we might have did something by pulling it down a little bit because it's kind of cuter. I just would pull it up a little over my belly button like that. And then we'll be straight. Yeah, we'll be good. Blue. You cannot be touching the camera. You wanna say hi? Say hi. Hi. Say hi, my boo. Hi, my boo. Aw, oh, Blue would've been so sad without me. Okay, and let me just show you guys this top just because I have it on. This top is from Touch Dolls. We'll get into that boutique because I did get some dresses from them as well um but this top is from Touch Dolls it's just a bralette style um there isn't like an adjustable clasp or anything so I would say order your size um that you are usually in I got this in a medium um and there is a little bit of like that elastic uh backing so you have a, enough stretch but still order your size just to be safe honestly now that I've seen this together and the more I'm like walking back and forth I'm not mad at this little combo. I probably wouldn't have paired it with such a embellished bralette just because there's already a print on the bottom. Like when I come close, you guys can really see how embellished it is. There we go. You can see the lace detail, um, which is super pretty, but I probably would do it with something a little more subtle on the bottom. Or am I tripping y'all? Am I tripping? Would this look cute together? Like as a, a thing? Probably a different type of top for sure because the bottom is giving me like cream white and this is giving me like stark white. That's why it's throwing me off. Okay. Anywho, let's get into the next one. Okay, guys, this little number is also from Shein. Give it a moment. I feel like when I picked out this dress, I was envisioning me and my man walking down the beach. Honestly, this is a like, oh, are we going to have breakfast on the beach this morning? Oh, are we going to take a stroll? This is like a strolling, just very casual, but feminine style dress. And red is so out of my comfort zone, y'all. I never wear red, but that's my man's favorite color. He loves to see me in it. So here we are trying to do things. Here is the back, get into the back. It's really the back that sold me on it. Clearly, I'm here for the backless, deep back, cut out things. Um, but I think it's the fit of the front that is throwing it off for me um or it might just be the fact that I'm a little bit taller so it's not really falling on the ground the way I want it to if you can tell in the mirror if you like direct your eyes yeah so. there we go okay so you can kind of see where it stops on the floor um 
just by looking at that. And this was that one dress that I was talking about where the slip is not a bodycon suit, so it's just like it's flowing with the dress. I feel like that's what makes it harder for it to look like it falls nicely um, and give it structure. So maybe, maybe if I even like made it the, the skirt, I don't know. let's see. What if I like made this tighter? And then because it's the way that the fabric is falling over top of this fabric underneath. But nevertheless, the dress is really cute. I think it might have been around like $20 if that. So if I only end up wearing it once, hey, I probably spent way more than $20 on something else. Uh, I definitely would check out this dress if you are into like those maxi style just summer you want to try something different you guys see how i have been giving you all different types of colors in this dress haul come on now <laughs> your girl is getting out of her comfort zone i probably wouldn't have worn this on the trip um and majority of this stuff that i bought was not for the trip it actually was just because i need to revamp my spring everything um and just yeah it's time okay it is time so i don't want to wait until i have something to do shopping for it i'd rather just have it in my clothes and already get into the habit of wearing stuff so yes this is this dress clearly i'm just having fun in it this i think i just brought this dress to just be frilly and cute in it not necessarily for sex appeal all right let's get into the next dress okay guys i had to backtrack a little bit because i said there was only one dress from pretty little thing there was two. Forgot to show you guys this one because I didn't plan on taking this off with me at all. This was one of those things where I just wanted to have a nice slip dress. This really soft light pink was screaming my name and I had to have something like it in my wardrobe and ready to go on the go. Excuse my panty lines like I said. But <laughs> this is this slip dress. If you guys can see in the mirror there is a cute high little slip. Clearly we're in love with the slip. Um, and then that cowlick, I honestly am starting to love tops like this on my body. Um, I feel like it looks very feminine and just, it's giving you a lot of, of, of sexy without giving you a lot of sexy. Does that make sense? I am definitely here for that style. I feel like that is my style as I am like getting into my true style of, of what I like, what I like to shop for. So this is just one of those cute slip on slip dresses from Pretty Little Thing. I got it in a size 10. Um, definitely think a 10 was good for me. I like the way that the material falls. Could it have been like form fitting? Absolutely. But do we want to have to suck in all night? No. So a 10 is fine. A 10 is cool. We can breathe. We can move. Whose wedding am I going to? Let me know. Now y'all, y'all know this. Hold on. I know this is so far out of my comfort zone and I have my hands right here because it's so see-through um, and I don't have any type of pasty, nothing. I'm not trying to get flagged by YouTube. But this dress, oh, this dress is so bomb. So bomb. I'm not even gonna turn all the way around because you will see straight through, oh, sorry. You will see straight through it. Um, touch dolls. We have moved on to a different brand. This is an Instagram boutique. Actually, let me just put my hair right here. So, so we can see the dress. Okay, here we go, boom. This dress is from Touch Dolls. See this dress? It honestly is supposed to be a lot lower, like right here where your belly button, where your belly button would show. Um, and then these kind of, these strings kind of like intertwined in between. And then obviously you see the back can't turn all the way around but get a peek in the mirror if you can completely backless so this is for my girls who you know you're, you're feeling confident this summertime you feel confident this spring you want to show them all it's it's everything that exudes confidence first of all it's white second of all it's tight third of all it's backless like come on so i am definitely gonna get some more out of this hit the gym a couple more times wait until we're not on that time of the month so that we can see what we're truly working with because this is bloat me. Um, but baby, this dress is um, touch dolls. Did not come to play with the girls. Did not come to play. This is the one. This, if, if anything was the one, this might've just been a runner up <laughs> because I got some other ones that I think might be a little, a little on the same level. Hold on, let me show y'all. 
Dutch dogs can have my money for the rest of my life. I don't care because y'all see this dress? Y'all. Y'all, the dress. The, the, the dress, the dress. It's giving boss, it's giving hip, it's giving vacation. Oh yes, I can see this with like a really bomb, like neon bright heel or yellow heel, green heel, some type of color. This definitely would look good with a colored heel, multicolored heel, just something to, Oh, I'm obsessed with this dress. You guys, this is, um, this dress is from Touch Dolls. I got it in a size large. I'm ready to go to someone's rooftop party. Where are we going? Because this is getting, <laughs> this is right up my alley. This is right up my alley of like what I would wear out. This is exhibit A. Next dress. dolls okay literally touch doll fashion is the category that we are all looking for <laughs> this dress is so bomb and so simplistic and just giving me everything that i needed more even on the dress is giving me everything that i needed it is this sexy midi length it stops right above the knee halter body con bandage just so many different adjectives we can use to describe dress i got in a small um i'm actually glad i got it in a small because it's pretty like stretchy material um and i did want it to be this form fitting and i knew i was going to be in the gym prior to next week so yeah this would have been looking real bomb banging um again white dress probably would have sliced it up with some heels and a cute bag just do i have to put on anything else i don't even want to put on anything else i think this is it let's just one more time for this dress <laughs> On next dress and last but not least undress fashion this rouge halter top dress is from um undress fashion and i got it in a medium i love this color okay like i don't think there's anything else left to say other than absolutely love this color on my skin tone i'm gonna get close so you guys can see but i'm gonna keep my hands right here because we don't have any pasties on but just so you can see the color of the dress is this really pretty mint green and then there's this ruched uh material down here i have been seeing dresses like this trend but i like this one a lot more because it doesn't have like that um drawstring to make it tighter i don't know like to me I feel like this dress just looks better without that part and which is also why I was on the hunt to find something like it and when I did it was a done deal okay it was a done deal she did have this this dress in other colors like white and I think like a salmon but we're trying to expand our horizons and I already bought a white dress like the one you guys just saw so this one looked exactly the same now this one was definitely supposed to come on the trip with us um <laughs> She was definitely supposed to ride, uh, but she'll be riding on the next trip for sure. And yeah, that's it. Oh my gosh, you guys, my stomach is now cramping up, which is perfect timing because it's the end of this vlog. Let's close it out.
Okay, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this vacation dress haul. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to leave a comment down below letting me know what you guys want to see next. I did only include the dresses from this haul, so there's a lot of other pieces that you guys didn't get to see. So if you want to see another haul, now's your time. Be sure to turn on my bell notification so that you are notified whenever I upload another video. I have vlogs that I upload weekly, makeup tutorials, lash business, just got out of school, any type of stuff related to that. This is your channel and I'm your girl. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Till next time, lay babes.